Well, hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Live and Laugh with Linda. I'm Linda and today is going to be another mobile home tour. It's going to be episode three, which is my fall day core. So here we have, I got my fall shirt on. I'm ready for the season and I've got my outside decor out. I've got a lot of fun things that's going on as you can see. And what I'm gonna do is let you see outside and then we're gonna go inside. So come on in and join us. Welcome to my home, y'all. Happy fall. Well, as y'all know, I absolutely love to decorate and I am not a less is more kind of girl. I'm definitely more is more and I love color. As far as my basic fall decor goes, I usually just go with a harvest theme, um, also with Thanksgiving theme. Never been much on Halloween decorating, just never done it. But anyway, I keep it pretty simple. Let's go check it out. Y'all, I used to be quite the gardener back in the day, believe it or not. And I loved color. I loved flowers and flower gardens, and I used to really enjoy working out in them. But I can't hardly get down and do the things I used to could, being the old lady that I'm getting to be. So now I just mostly maintain this little front flower garden in the summer. I don't do a whole lot of planting in the winter time, but I enjoy this in the summer. I have cannas and lilies, and as you might imagine, lots of color. But they've all been cut back now because we're ready to move on to fall, and those hot summer plants, tropical plants, are about done. So I had to make room for all my little scarecrow friends, anyway, that have come to visit. So let's just keep on looking at fall. Well, here we are at my happy place. Y'all, welcome to my porch. I'd love for you to drop by. Come on by anytime. Let's set us a spell. We can have a glass of iced tea and sit and rock away the time and enjoy this beautiful fall weather. So here we are at the front door. Welcome in y'all. Let's go look at fall. You know, I think a lot of us are just products of our environment and how we grew up. And I'll have to give my mom her props for really teaching us to put a little decor out for every little old holiday. Mother always used to say, listen, memories don't just happen, you have to plan them. 
So she was always one to put a little tiny little figurine or something up for just about every holiday. And that's why I love it so much today. What are some of your traditions that you'd like to share? Leave me some, some, uh, some of your traditions in the comments. Another thing mother taught me was you don't have to spend a lot of money. Most everything mother had, she, she made, uh, made herself. She would crochet little decor things, or she would just, sometimes we'd sit and make them out of construction paper. But you don't have to spend a lot of money. Most things I pick up at the dollar store. I pick up some things uh, at the Hobby Lobby because they run such fabulous sales, but you don't have to spend a lot of money. And then I keep them forever and ever. Most all this stuff I've had for a long, long time. But it's not about how much you spend or how trendy it is. It's about, you know, what makes you feel the season, what gives you pleasure, and what things that you love. And your kids will remember it too. They sure will. It's not Thanksgiving quite just yet, but I just go on ahead and put it all out at once. I certainly don't want to have to do it all over again in another month, but I love my Thanksgiving characters, and it goes along with my theme of harvest and give thanks.
about wraps up this video today about my fall decor, and I can't thank you enough for dropping by. I pray y'all be blessed today, find something to smile about, and happy fall, y'all.